Hi, today uh, I'm going to uh, explain shortly uh, what uh, vStudio functions we are launching have uh, different features uh, from previous one. So this vStudio is uh, really uh, providing you the tools how you create unlimited beautiful studios. So any uh, person without 2D, 3D designer, without any operator, you can create your own studio uh, beautifully uh, with the tools, with the only tools we are providing in vStudio or iStudio. So previous time we explained many uh, methods in iStudio, but this time the vStudio has some more flexibility than iStudio, so you can do very beautiful uh, studio creation by yourself. Very simple way I will explain how you change the desk, how you change the floor, everything which is a kind of logo matching, lo logo construction of the studio, similar concept we are providing. For example, uh, I will show you how quickly uh, you can uh, feel the different atmosphere. For example, here we have uh, uh, the, the background. So let's use uh, some graphic, any graphic you can put there. The colors, I just put some color like a, a small uh, color matching here. And then in the uh, left side also we can put uh, this kind of things. And right side, uh, let's say uh, we can put similar one. So that way we make a three wall with the uh, colors there. And then uh, even the floor color, uh, we can slightly change, uh, for example, Without any designer, you can change color tones like this. Uh, with some, some, the red color here, maybe uh, we can make a uh, in-between color, so it will match like this way. The wall also, uh, we can make a transparent wall or a different walls there. For example, I can, I can make a color change to, to have different color from, from the wall. So some blue color, some red color, or different wall texture if you have uh, any, anything. Just using um, PowerPoint or whatever, you just make a PNG file and put there, you will have a different feelings. That way we, we make. The second step uh, the broadcaster is doing after they have a nice studio there. And then they, they put the camera and they put the, uh, the TV screen uh, where they show PowerPoint, whatever the presentation environment. So now we, ha we have, a, uh, right now I have a three, uh, I, I would call virtual electric whiteboard where you can show uh, whatever you want, PowerPoint file, PDF file, videos, files, or notebooks, even from your, your mobile phone, whatever you can bring there. So quickly I can show how we bring these kind of things here. So let's say this screen, I want to bring the, the, uh, the menu, uh, I mean GUI screen which we to this. So one of the monitor we can bring there. To, to make it simple, I can bring some of the TV screen here. So this is the camera I'm using. So the, 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 the room I'm here. And also in front, we have uh, this kind of uh, screen. So we studio system, we are providing you all these uh, five TV screens where you can see everything, so you can manage everything by yourself. Basically, uh, we are trying to bring all the other people from any place in the world using Zoom or Skype or li uh, links, whatever, a go meeting, whatever you use for your uh, video conference. We have seamlessly integrated with the software and hardware, so you don't have to worry about uh, to use your existing program. The only thing we are providing is the beautiful output we feed to your uh, existing video conference like Skype. For example, instead of your camera, we bring this output. Exactly the same video you are watching will go to Skype, so all the other people will see your studio like this way. This is our telepresentation pattern technology. So uh, now I will bring the uh, screen uh, to this uh, uh, the screen here. I'm showing the uh, VStudio GUI. So whatever you want to show, we can switch. If you press anything, they, they can show. 
So for example, we have uh, six uh, virtual electric whiteboard. You can put more, more screens or you can bring more teams there. So one, one group, you can use uh, one camera for, for the, the one group presentation. Another announcer showing weather, for example. So uh, theoretically, we can bring the Skype people here to show us like they are sitting by you to make a real-time presentation there together. Even the teacher is, uh, is far away, then we can combine them here and broadcasting together in real time. So uh, after we have this kind of menu, for example, uh, uh, I, can, I can show here, for example, the VStudio screen. This is the VStudio. And here, the monitor one, where I have a PowerPoint from my, from my notebook uh, screen. So my notebook here has uh, this PowerPoint. The topic of today's uh, speech is how we make uh, not only TV broadcasting, but also smartphone, YouTube, Facebook Live, which is called telepresentation system. So if you imagine all the te technical uh, part used for TV broadcasting, we are simply using same idea, but for yourself. For the novice people who does not know the broadcast technology, they can, they can use this machine for your self-presentation. So first thing uh, they have to do is uh, creating studio. It's like a TV people, always they are thinking which studio they are going to use for, for uh, recording and presenting. So now uh, we uh, just make uh, uh, the, uh, the studio like this way. Uh, again, I would say unlimited studios you can create by yourself. And we are providing many standard uh, studio, rectangle studio, round studio, and a spatial studio where you can edit everything without knowledge of 3D design or 2D design. We are providing all the color changing, all the texture change, all the alpha value changing, all the gamma change from my machine, so you don't need to use that one. You don't need any switcher mixer because we already have a switcher mixer with a very beautiful uh, way of GBG as like you are watching. All the scene now is automatic. So here, the, uh, the, the uh, Taring company, uh, we make an uh, iStudio so far. At the same time, we are announcing iStudio 4000, which is a similar function, but much easier, uh, much more flexible for any person. But vStudio is a, a little bit professional for you to create TV broadcasters doing CNN style of the uh, studios you can create. So uh, the, the first step, I show you how you make uh, uh, the uh, studio. Second step is how you uh, combine the camera, switching this way or that way. Another camera showing on here, another camera showing there. So now I have a one camera scene like this way. This is uh, the camera action there. And then uh, if you want to have a... a the different feeling like this, you can make a camera action there. And then you can make a slightly bigger to show yourself uh, big. Because presentation always showing teacher is the most important part. So if you look at all the video in YouTube, the biggest, what a pity thing is, presenters, gestures, emotions, their face not showing very, very clearly. That's a very big uh, missing part on a presentation video. So I'm very emphasizing all the presentation here has to bring the presenter's face very big. So sometimes you, you show yourself together with a virtual monitor. Sometimes you can uh, show you this kind of a screen like that way. So another screen coming out, but always we are pro the, providing you the scene where the presenter and presenter's face coming together. So uh, on this uh, the, the VStudio menu, so all the, the, the items which you bring here, desktop or videos, pictures, live cameras, everything here you can switch. For example, I can, I can bring this, uh, uh, this is a live camera, so if I press this one, you will see this one is showing on here. So uh, we can show where I'm, I'm doing this. Actually, if you have a slightly clean room, we can put five TV screen. Uh, where you can bring uh, the Skype people or uh, 
links people or the Zoom, uh, any person who is using video conference, they, they bring on one of the screen. And actually, you don't need to watch this because I'm, I'm trying to explain what uh, VStudio can do. But basically, you can put here YouTube, Facebook, live in simultaneously from the VStudio. And then we have a notebook PowerPoint, which uh, I can see from my notebook, but anyway, if I have a PowerPoint file, I can see more clearly to bring that one to there. And we have a smartphone here. So for example, I can, I can make a smartphone screen. So for example, I can bring this part. This one now is showing the PowerPoint. You see the, the screen here. Uh, unfortunately, this is too small, but anyway, here I can show the same way uh, on, on this one. Uh, you see, uh, whatever I, I point, that, that brings automatically. This is very intelligent function, how they can show many, many beautiful things there. So here we have a, a camera like this, or we can make a, the screen here, or I can make a PowerPoint, which is the file of the PowerPoint file. So uh, this one automatically bring the PowerPoint file and then you can see the next slide. We, we use this one in the live screen. This is what this, uh, the PowerPoint is showing. This is not the notebook screen, the PowerPoint. So there we can show the PowerPoint file. One interesting thing we have here is when you have a titling, for example, like, let's say title layer. So the, all the uh, prepared title text coming out automatically uh, from here without any operator there. But when you have uh, the, the right uh, the, the title to show on this uh, uh, title layer, uh, then uh, every time you have to check this, this word or that line you have to bring. But instead of selecting the lines you prepare, we make automatic titling coming out from PowerPoint file. So if you look at the PowerPoint file, I'll bring the, uh, another screen. Uh, which means um, uh, the, let's say, yeah, this is a PowerPoint uh, screen, so I can, I can bring this one bigger. The, the uh, not this one, but the PowerPoint screen is, uh, where is the PowerPoint the desktop for, okay, I can bring here. So uh, uh, this one, so this one is means uh, we have a, a screen two, uh, this is our screen, so I can bring that uh, VStudio. Here we, I, can, I can bring the uh, PowerPoint file. But here, uh, what I'm showing on this uh, second monitor is the, another TV screen. I mean the monitor in VStudio. So uh, this screen has a PowerPoint preview there. And very interesting thing we have here uh, is on this screen, you will see some box here, uh, which is uh, we call prompt screen. So here, the prompt screen, basically, you can make a bigger uh, text, whatever, uh, any size of text uh, from your PowerPoint note. So th this, uh, this prompt you can read when you make a presentation in real time, because always many people just preparing the note from the PowerPoint. So the new uh, uh, pattern applying technology is how we make a PowerPoint text on this virtual studio. We make a very special way to make a very smooth titling coming out. So if you look at here, I mean the, the PowerPoint preview window where you can make uh, uh, the uh, prompt uh, bigger or we can make a titling from PowerPoint. So if you see here, very uh, clearly here, you will see uh, this is a PowerPoint file, so you cannot show. But anyway, what I'm uh, trying here is showing this on full screen. So in this screen, you will see this kind of uh, uh, note uh, textures here, text here. So exactly this word is coming out here. For example, if I make a next page here, next page has a different titling coming out. So the uh, Titling, uh, I'm sorry, the titling option. You see, I just click here, the title from the note. Then this word is coming to here. So that way, if I change, it automatically changes. That way, we can make a very beautiful uh, the broadcasting uh, titling.
titling and switching and content switching and camera actions from there. So that's a really uh, self-operated system where you can make a very beautiful studios by yourself. So if I switch back to here to my notebook, so notebook screen, uh, I mean the the my notebook is now showing this uh, this part. So the telepresentation is really possible uh, questions there. So I would say, uh, as like you are watching my video, you will get answer uh, that all the students who is watching this video will feel like uh, you are presenting in front of their students. This is not only just simply making presentation in distance place, but this means we enhance the way how to present. So, uh, sorry for my English. English is very li limited from, from Korean. So I'm I just uh, learning all English by myself. So my pronunciation and uh, all the English is, uh, is not good, but hope hope you understand the technology part. So uh, I'm, I'm doing my best to explain what uh, I made for this V-Studio. So V-Studio's innovation is making very beautiful studio by yourself. All the 3D, about 50 different uh, the studios we are providing where you can modify, change everything as like I show you simply. But there are a lot more features you can, you can uh, the, uh, enjoy for creating your studio. After that, once you have a studio, the next step is uh, you have to put the camera actions. So one camera here, another camera. I mean virtual camera, not, not real camera. Real camera you use for bring your video on this uh, studio. Students video on this virtual monitor. Or Skype uh, another person, if they have a background green or blue, we can chroma can bring these uh, people together with you. And all the, uh, the uh, screen, when you teach the Photoshop, Photoshop screen we can bring there, the, uh, many different functions. And the camera as I show you, and then the, uh, any uh, Windows application you can bring there. And also, for example, here we have uh, uh, the, the, my mobile phone. So if I click the mobile phone, the, the screen will show the mobile phone screen. This is uh, exactly the mobile phone game is uh, broadcasting, sorry, I cannot see this broadcasting. So we have, uh, we have uh, some uh, video I made uh, two days ago. This is, uh, this is my video, uh, which is uh, uh, one of the uh, presentations I made in, in my YouTube. So I, I won't make this one uh, bigger. So if I make this rotation in the side, you see the screens coming out. So this is a this is a, a presentation I, I made yesterday. Yeah. Many beautiful studios. It's so one of the example how we make a, a beautiful studio uh, in in a very different way. A little bit complicated studio we can make now. The streaming from my mobile to this machine is like this uh, slow. But anyway. I am trying to explain you what kind of uh, content we can we can show for your presentation. Sometimes handphone, sometimes notebook screen, sometimes PowerPoint file, sometimes uh, PDF file, cameras, screens, Windows application, and so on. And uh, uh, this way, you really make your presentation in real time. I never practiced to have this uh, presentation. I don't want to make a. Uh, something different from what I have. My English level is this. My presentation is a uh, notebook, uh, the smartphone, everything. So uh, from this technology, uh, you will have uh, several hundred of examples how, how you can use. So from that on, you can easily understand and modify and you can use immediately. I would say within 30 minutes, if you watch the small tutorial video, and then you can do by yourself. The uh, setting of this uh, V-Studio on your place, your classroom, your meeting room, is just a matter of one hour. We just bring everything ready, system, connect the TV, and that's all. All the cameras and microphone we put there together, so all the system, the V-Studio is not only the server. V-Studio is a complete broadcast station, the green screen coming together, bright, the light coming together, and also cameras there. Of course, if you have your camera, we recommend you to use your camera, which is maybe much better than what I'm using now. 
Anyway, so uh, once you create studio from unlimited uh, studio you can create by yourself. Also, we are providing ready to use one, uh, slightly uh, make you easier. And then all the camera action with uh, the predefined monitors uh, scene, we already provide you because once you try to make a three virtual monitor and when present a you know, seven inch screen, if you try to show, there are several uh, scenes you can compose. So we know what, uh, what kind of scene the professional PDs will make. That's what we uh, make that one. Now all the, all the motion, I, I'm not touching anything. I don't have any person around, but all the intelligent function of this uh, V-Studio doing by himself. So this is the idea how we do this um, uh, the camera switching without any machine there. Only thing you need is a pointer. So this pointer always pointing where you are teaching. So here we have a, a PowerPoint. So I want I want to bring the the uh, 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 name to remind you which company making this. This is a very unique company in the world. So we we are uh, trying to uh, changing the error of presentation. I, I just say we are really opening the new era of presentation there. So uh, this one really uh, making tele-presentation. All the system uh, from Cisco, from Polycom, whatever, I would, I would not say this is a real tele-presentation system. They, they claim this is a tele-presentation system. That's why so far no product available for tele-presentation. Now you can understand how we do present. If you're assuming this video going to the uh, students in the classroom, their projector will show using Skype or Zoom, then you can imagine when you are watching this video, it's exactly showing the video on the projector screen. So you can uh, watch the students, you can make an interactive presentation there. So uh, that's why we, we make this kind of a room. For example, my office, this is office, it's not studio, office. We have a TV, very, very nasty environment. Of course, I will clean up, but today I'm just showing the, the real, real uh, environment. So we have a four monitor here. You can bring students here because my room is only three meter wide, so I can put four TV there. So we make a, a four screen here, and also this is a, this is one of the uh, monitor for my notebook to connect to see the front of PowerPoint file. So this file is showing there. So you can bring the another student. You don't need to uh, to open this uh, to the menu because everything automatically make. This is only for setting or changing the size. This kind of things you can do here. Anyway, uh, that way uh, you can uh, uh, make uh, something uh, the beautiful way. You see, if I put that uh, camera over here, it, it immediately becomes uh, very beautiful. So this is the room where I'm doing. So this green uh, green painting we, we uh, put there. That way uh, we can make a beautiful studio there. Anyway, uh, from this idea, as I mentioned, we are really making telepresentation is, is possible. So I can I can make uh, my note here. So the uh, system from Cisco. Uh, what they are using right now is they have uh, presenting people here, but they usually have uh, PowerPoint here or notebook there. They are not so flexible to change everything very quickly. So they have a notebook. From the notebook screen, you can prepare everything when you want to present there. So this is uh, two TV. One is a PPT, presenting material going there. Another one is a presenter's, uh, presenter's video uh, there. So uh, the, the way you are watching is very different from the way from other telepresent system. That's why we call this is a telepresenter system rather than calling telepresent system. So we show this way for many conference area, many classrooms using this way, showing the, the project screen. I'm recommending this machine to use in the classroom, to use in your office, to use your meeting room, to use this one in auditorium room. Imagine this screen going very big, LED projector screen, whatever. And then the presenter's face becomes 50 times bigger face and everybody remember what they are talking.
So some reason God create the people who has a, some kind of gesture. I don't practice how to use my hand, but automatically my face and this one coming out. So this gesture is very important to show for your presentation. When you keep talking, this question intelligently you know, so they just bring back to show yourself slightly more comfortable way and come and bring back to you. So all the audience will have more relaxation, uh, listening only audio. So he, in, in, on this screen, uh, I'm showing the uh, the way how we are doing, so the pattern part, we create AR VR studio. This machine don't have to use only with the chroma key. They can use the non chroma key environment as like the production switches. And we are using virtual electric wire because we use a PowerPoint in the, in the screen and then we use a pointer like this. VR camera, like uh, right now, it automatically make a bigger and smaller changing, very intelligent way to make a smart PD function. So you don't need a very smart production director there because uh, the V-Studio and I-Studio do all this mission by themselves. So they are very intelligently control the scene. So that way we show uh, AR, VR classroom. So you see uh, the, the, the background is a studio, I mean graphical studio. And then we bring the presenter's face here as like myself. And then we bring virtual table if you need, we can put that one. And also all the notebook, uh, smartphone or PPT file directly from our machine. All the other students, the remote students, so they show in the, in the Skype, whatever we can bring here. So when they make a question, you can make a discussion through the Skype or Zoom or uh, go meeting, whatever. And then this one combined and showing in the YouTube video to make a uh, live broadcasting. Whatever you have a uh, uh, streaming uh, streaming server, the ISO is providing this one to there, so you can use this one in your Kaltura, in your uh, video platform. All the same as machine, you can connect without any any problems. So uh, this is one of the example how we make um, AL Studio. So we crop specially to bring yourself on there. And optionally, you can use uh, lecture tracking. We are providing also very intelligent uh, tracking camera, so you can put this one in the classroom without any green, they can go. Once the presenter coming to the area where you have a background green, you will make a virtual environment immediately. It's kind of a hybrid method to make a very beautiful production virtual studio and production switcher functions there. So the, uh, if you remind the uh, uh, telepresence system one more time, the Cisco machine, they have a presenter here, they have a PowerPoint in there. So the distance place will have a two stream, presenter's video and also PowerPoint. So this, uh, normally this one we put in a projector screen. But after five minutes, ten minutes, nobody watching here because he, he's just uh, there. But uh, when we have uh, this uh, ICD function, so we have, uh, uh, we use this Cisco camera to bring not presenter's uh, video, but the participant video. Because we are combining this one showing here together with the presenter and presenting person there. That way they can really make the presentation. For example, now I'm, I'm uh, just showing my, my uh, mobile phone showing the, uh, I'm doing the distance uh, presentation from London to the seminar room in Microsoft in Korea. So my video showing over here and also I'm watching another monitor, this uh, participant here, students there, and then I make a real-time question and answer. Uh, this is uh, my uh, mobile phone uh, now uh, streaming, that's why the quality is slightly low. The, uh, the uh, Wi-Fi transmission looks a little slow from, from here. So that way uh, we can really make a telepresentation. So this means the, the, the participant on distance place, I mean classroom students coming out and my video coming out and my video going to another classroom. Unlimited classroom can see there. So this is a really this part and is a virtual class, this part is a student. So the people who is watching this video, they feel like they are sitting together. So that is the idea how we make a, a real-time television. Of 
course, the uh, same time we make a YouTube live, we do Facebook live, so from one machine you can do multiple functions. So without adding another server to have a YouTube streaming, to have a Facebook streaming, recording, or a video conference, you don't need to have another machine. You just make a Facebook machine to do all these features. So uh, uh, one more time, when you have an uh, iStudio machine, if you uh, 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 try to use that machine together with Cisco machine, let's assume we have a Cisco machine where they have two input. One is, one is the presenter's camera, we go there. Uh, but uh, this one you use a uh, participant to, to show there. But our iStudio camera, we combining presenter and presenting material to have this kind of output, as like you are watching now. This output from iStudio machine going to Cisco machine, and then the, the, their camera use a participant, two stream going here, one participant camera showing on the second monitor in Cisco machine, another one is here. But when uh, you use iStudio for the, the people who doesn't have a Cisco machine, so they uh, if they don't have a Cisco machine, the iStudio directly sending Skype uh, output to show combined output to there. So the, the uh, distance place people don't need to have a Cisco, but they just use a mobile phone or uh, any uh, computer. So this computer output you can put in the projector screen that all the students can see. And the computer notebook camera bring their students to you, so you will see the students in the second monitor, as I show, my environment has uh, four TV. So one of the TV you can show distant students there. So that way uh, we, we make a presentation. But when uh, the other person has only one camera, they just making, we, we make uh, iStudio, the Cisco, uh, I mean the, the, the distance uh, c conference person we bring here, and combining together and broadcast. So all the people who is watching YouTube video also can see that kind of things. So the, uh, another application of vStudio, uh, we put this one in the real auditorium room. The output screen is like you're watching showing there. So the, you can immediately turn your auditorium room, your classroom, as like uh, the theater looks studio. Beautiful. And also, you can put another uh, TV, uh, whatever, uh, to bring uh, distance uh, classroom uh, there. So uh, all the other auditorium uh, people uh, can uh, show uh, there together. Uh, so we we uh, test uh, this one in in, in uh, many uh, places. Uh, so this is uh, 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 actually uh, the uh, screen uh, we use uh, uh, several years uh, uh, for uh, the uh, testing. Uh, so yeah, this one really uh, make uh, a presentation. Uh, you know, uh, if you put the green. Uh, they make a virtual, if they, no, they don't have a green, then you can use a AR studio. So we basically uh, make a virtual conference from one place to another place. This is the, how we make a telepresentation for creating virtual uh, the conferences. So many people have to travel to listen to that one. And also many presenters have to go there to have their presentation. But from now, once we have a V-Studio, you can make a better presentation than real uh, real place if you look at all the video from from many famous conferences you will be disappointed to see how they are showing in the uh, in the youtube so many many way we can do uh, the conference we can make that way uh, so this is a new revolution uh, method how we make a distance presentation this is one of the example we show in a large auditorium in, in, in one of the uh, biggest uh, research center in korea so when they have a question, uh, there is a question, uh, one person make a question, then we bring this one directly from the camera to here and the presenter and PowerPoint. So this screen showing there. So all the people, when he make a question, they don't have to see this person, but they have to see this part. So if they have one more TV, we can bring distance place people to have to on the screen so they can see virtually as like uh, they, they are uh, sitting together. So that way we can make a tele, tele uh, presentation from everywhere. So you will see how nicely they are showing from my studio 
and also their conference room. So this year they will put one more screen with our new technology, which is called uh, Max Vision. We are providing so where we can make a multiple input to have a different showing uh, there too. So we are not only working for making beautiful video presentation screen on your mobile phone, but also we are providing. The another advanced uh, the uh, auditorium screen or multiple LED. We, com we, we are composing different way to make a more better presentation uh, in large audience uh, audience room or classroom. So I hope you enjoy my presentation today. So we are uh, we are providing the new revolutionary uh, system for presentation. The revolution is the first you can make a beautiful studio by yourself without any designer without any Photoshop. Second, you can make a camera action. It's like a cameraman. We put the one camera here, another camera there. Third, we can make uh, all the uh, switching, mixing from the machine without any uh, operators behind. So uh, imagine if you work together with the uh, with the operator, with the technical engineer, then you have a lot of problem because you have to communicate. Whenever you want to show there, you have to sign so he can make a change. Otherwise, you have to record and edit. So this uh, V-Studio machine, iStudio machine, which we are announcing, don't need basically no editing. The video I'm making is a real time, everything real time. I, I have no time to make editing. All the titling, all the recordings, all the streaming is made by myself. I would say within one week, you will make a professional broadcasting person. It's like a broadcast engineer. You, uh, you create studio, you create camera action, you modify. And also you can make a self-studio to make a beautiful studio like I'm doing now. So again, and this all uh, action is done by V-Studio Intelligent Function, AI Function, Artificial Intelligence really working for this iStudio. So we, we bring the idea which the professional PD is doing. So this one very clever, so they will make a very nice. All the uh, things you should know is how to use your pointer to, to make a pointing where you are doing presentation there. So the, uh, all the ideas we are uh, showing today is a really new generation. So we are making the virtual electric whiteboard technology where you can show different content in different windows. And also all this one is uh, uh, very quickly, easily uh, made. There are many, many techniques we put. For example, when you go second screen, the second screen content automatically being on, on the monitor. So there you can show many things. There are, for example, graphics, the, uh, logos, and then the PowerPoint file. So the different PowerPoint file loading. So they can show like this. So the today is really opening telepresentation. So we make a, a, a telepresentation.com site. I mean, not the OLG site. Telepresenter is the real uh, the important word which everybody has to change. So far, you are meeting them always when the people are coming, you have present to them. To them. At the same time, if you use a uh, V-Studio, they will see the screen instead of watching you or your notebook, but they will just watch it like you are watching my video. That way, even they come, they watch the screen. If they come to your classroom, they will watch the TV or project screen. And same project screen going to smartphone. That's the idea how we make a telepresentation. Once I prove showing this way of live presentation is better than conventional way, that means you can change the way how you present in the classroom. Once you prove this one, I, I already make many, many presentations this way in the classroom, university, and conference room, uh, even uh, Ministry of Education use this one to show how presentation creates. So once we put that machine for making live broadcasting in the conference hall, in the hotels, uh, on the conference, so the screen showing uh, exactly the same video there, as like I'm doing now. And then that means it can be recorded, it can be broadcasted. So that's the key part how we make a telepresentation uh, which is almost, I would say, much better than the conventional way of local presentation. 
So uh, the, uh, there are many uh, things we need to make this one really happening. So year 2020 is really connecting all the smartphones to your place. So all the uh, planet, uh, different countries, uh, different places, even different times, your presentation go everywhere if they really want to see. That's the idea how we are trying to bring this uh, V-Studio machine on this uh, new generation. Yes, I, I completely believe the V-Studio technique will change the era of classroom, the era of video conference, the era of smart presentation. I'm defining the smart class is the class as you are watching my video. So from the smartphone, you will see presenter and presenting material better than any other technique existed on this planet. I would say this is a really revolutionary way of TV broadcasting, revolutionary way of how you make a live presentation from your place to any place. Hope you enjoy my English, Korean English, and also I believe you can understand what I'm, I'm doing there. So, the titling right now is, is uh, a little bit different from there, but I can, I can uh, remove the title. Anyway, thank you very much for watching my video. I hope you contact our local partners to make your new era of your company, new era of your meeting room, new era of your classroom, and even your office. Thank you very much. 3D Max를 여러분이 에, 다 만들어 쓰고 할수 없기 때문에 저도 3D Max를 하지 못합니다. 조금밖에 못하는데 그런 것이 없어도 방송을 할수 있게 만들려면 어떻게 할 것인가? 지금 방송국에 쓰고 있는 사실 이 에, 스튜디오 제작이라는 과정은 어, 간단하지가 않기 때문에 에, 마치 한문이 어려워서 한문을 쓰지 못한 것처럼 이런 방송 기술이 어려워서 살수 없는 그러한 그 문제들을 갖게 된다는 것입니다. 저는 이런 문제를 해결하기 위해서 어, 3D 정보, 3D 책상, 저벽 스크린을 몰라도 할수 있는 방법을 어떻게 할 것인가. 지금 여기 약간의 이제 그 